everyone, we're here to continue the spooky boy. Um, we got Vaughn back with his beard and the fancy man bun. We're gonna see what. I mean, the whole thing done. was nuts! After Valerie beat the ever living shit out of me, Cassius was nice enough to take me back to his lab and fix me up. The second time that guy saved my ass. I really owe him. The plan was to figure out a way to get you guys from Valerie. Then you left on the rocket, and uh, Valerie opened the vault, and just all oh, hell broke loose. I tried to find you guys, but eventually I started suspecting the worst. I didn't want to think that way, but... but... after a while, it's just hard not to lose hope. I knew you'd get through all this. You weren't meant to waste away sitting behind a desk. It was a standing desk, but... yeah. I think you're right. The whole thing was so surreal, you know? I mean, Helios crashing... But by the time the dust settled, everyone was gone. Except for the ones that made it to the escape pods. Never expected to be leading a bunch of Hyperion refugees. I mean, they were crawling out of those things like newborns. Just bleary-eyed and scared. Then you put your newly acquired Pandoran survival skills to work. You joke, but it definitely helped. <laughs> I mean, look, obviously, I'm no expert, but I was light years ahead of these pencil pushers. I found JR from distribution eating dirt. Literally, just sitting there, just shoving dirt into his mouth. Really disturbing. I mean, most of these people, they hadn't spent a waking hour doing anything but just sitting on their ass, getting sweatier and fatter. <sighs> Which is why we decided to make our base out of what was left of Helios. Cool, right? Whoa. Okay. Yeah, they're pretty deferential. Which is really odd for a bunch of ex-Hyperion. Hello! <laughs> Man, <laughs> will you look at these weirdos, huh? <laughs> <laughs> All right. They can be a little obsessive. <laughs> Actually, I wasn't expecting them to bow to you when we showed up. But me? Th this isn't for you? <laughs> You're kidding me. I wish I was. Look, they even have a shrine for him. Um, <laughs> that, that, that's a statue of Jack. Yes, very observant it was at one point, but uh, they went ahead and labeled it Reese. Someone tried to alter the face to look like you, but um, most of these guys are basically shitty at everything. I am pretty uncomfortable right now. That makes two of us. <laughs> Reese, you don't understand. To them... You are the great liberator. You see, you crashing Helios shed them of their corporate shackles. I guess we'll see how this goes. Hmm. Look, that one guy is standing on nothing on the left corner. You <laughs> didn't see it. It's gonna be the last. Usually, the episodes last around an hour and a half. Who are you? <laughs> wow. <laughs> My forehead isn't really that big. <laughs> Is it? I told you, they're sucky. Kill it with fire. <laughs> Hey! Oh, what? Did you forget we have a prisoner to interrogate? No. You're not even a little curious to hear what this guy has to say? I mean, yeah, but there's fruit. I'm talking to him. Okay, okay, okay. I'm coming. I'm doing the talking. Okay, I'll be the backup muscle. Ah. Why, I got a gun. Okay, cool. 
Then Fiona, you're back up, and I'll be good cop. What? Why do you get to be good cop? Because I called it. No, no, I'm good cop. <laughs> He saved our lives. Gah! We got answers and we want some questions. So you listen, buddy. You make sure to answer... This? Who are you? A truth seeker. Listen, you realize you're a prisoner in a bandit camp, right? Who knows what these people are capable of doing to you? I can't help you, unless you help me. So help me. I will break your... Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. I'm still bad cop, right? Is that, is that what we've decided on? Or else one of us, just slightly unclear which one, is gonna have to get mean. I saw people wearing those suits on the base. That means you were on Helios. Or at least around the crash site. Look, you obviously know us. You wouldn't be doing this if you didn't. So just... no more games. Oh, it cannot be I best. do know you. Better now than I ever have. I was best. there. I was there when Gordas was destroyed. I saw it, but I could not believe it. I had asked for only one thing. After giving so much, I had sacrificed everything for my friends. Only to be betrayed. You asked earlier who I am. The answer is simple. I am your friend. What about? Bye. Yeah, hi. Uh, I have a lot of questions. <laughs> you and me both. Hey. Gordas... Gordas was my friend, too. I didn't want to do that. I wanted to believe that, too. How is this even possible? I mean, he has how the are you body even standing here right now? Of freaking handsome Jack. I went back to you. I needed to survive. To find you. To learn the truth. <sighs> but why the disguise? I mean, why the secrecy? Huh? Why, why not just tell us? I was afraid if you knew who I was. You would lie about what happened. It is in your nature to lie. He's got a point there. Right, Hyperion guy, con artist. It checks out. I really am sorry about Gordas. I didn't have a choice. I know that now. I am sorry for not trusting you. Please forgive me. <laughs> Oh, come on. How can you be mad at that face? <laughs> that is a face, right? I'm sorry, too. <laughs> no need. You had your reasons. Okay, so obviously I'm excited to see Loaderbot, too. But that doesn't explain why you got us all together. I mean, I assume that's why you had me captured by that Kroger guy? Yes. Follow me. 
brought you together to help me assemble Gordas and summon the Vault of the Traveler. Whoa. Yeah. Heavy. Have you forgotten about the Vault Monster that nearly killed us? This time, it will be different. How? We will all be there to fight it. With some friends. We were unprepared. Weak. That won't be the case this time. That's not much of a plan. Not that I'm saying no. Bye. Have faith. We can find a way. Can't we just, you know, <laughs> assemble her enough to be half a Gordas before she gets to vault summoning size? No. The pieces were damaged during the blast. It's all or nothing. Killing the vault monster is the only way to ensure that Gortus can live in peace. The only way to save her. Whatever help the children of Helios can provide is at your service. Thank you. I don't have an army of former Hyperion weirdos. But I owe you my life. Anything for Gortus. Well, the endless riches is what usually motivates people. You are the best. Aww. So, you, me, LB, Bond's on board. Hell yeah, he is. I can get Sasha here. No, oh, uh, so she's, uh... How many more we need? Vault Hunter teams are most effective in groups of four. Two teams would optimize our chances of success. Okay, so we need three more members. Loaderbot, any suggestions? It's all you. Okay, no pressure. Just give me a second to think. What? Who's stopping you? I'm a visual thinker. Yeah, I don't know what that means. I, I know the words that you just said, but not together like that. She achieves clarity through visualization. Oh, oh, okay, well... You know, why didn't you just say that? Ooh! What? She's alive? How? Okay. Oh my fucking god. I can't do this! <laughs> what the fuck? Of course, I want to get Athena. I want to get, uh, what is it called? Let's see. This guy? August? When I get August? Of course, Springs is dating Athena, but also Zero is really adorable. I don't need this guy. Oh, Felix. How the fuck these guys are all dead? Oh yeah, Felix isn't dead. But Cassius? I don't know. Ooh, look at what is this? We didn't save enough money to pay for the whole time. I found someone new. He's experienced, but it looks like he's more than we can afford. Who was it? No point in saying. You'd just be disappointed. Uh. Ah. I see. This is how it's gonna roll through you. So we have three already. Okay, so... You sold out someone other than... That's you. I suppose there's always August. Son of Valery, top creator of the purple skag, August spent the maturity Majority of his life stabbing, shooting, and punching his way up to ranks of hollow points or crimes. Might be a little unstable, but he never turned. Knock you on your ass. This is gonna be interesting. Orcrus trading the vault key kill that got us in the speed. 
always be by with the student. I'm just gonna look if I get it. You honored Scooter's witch launch light. The new operator of Scooter's Garage is a master mechanic who recently relocated to Pandora with her girlfriend after getting Athena captured and then asking to build a rocket with probably over some One more. <gasps> you never identified yourself as a potential vault hunter to anyone. Who hasn't heard of your exploits? <gasps> Infamous assassin shrouded in mystery, we most recently crossed paths with Zero in the death rally where he over and the chance that you so might learn. I cannot get him, <laughs> but I was so good to him. Oh, you prevented Athena from killing Cassid. Those he owes you a favor. Okay, I know this is random, but what about Cassius? As known as Seriously. Cassius. Clearly, the guy has a couple of screws loose. <laughs> last known at last, in the yes, the I know, but maybe a crazy scientist is just yeah, but he also kind of saved my life. That's cool, right? Though the years he's been in isolation have sanity cast his wealth of back for it would be highly valuable in any common scenario. Maybe don't mention. <laughs> You learned quickly under Athena's tutelage. She recognizes your A living legend, Athena's experience in taking down vault guardians would be extremely valuable. Despite the fact that she was last seen being dragged away by two vault hunters, it's doubtful that anyone could keep a mental package out of sits tooth kit. Warm, nurturing person. Well, I cannot get him. I definitely won't pick him. I cannot get this because I'm out of money. Because I wasted everything. I don't really like springs, and I have hots for Athena, so I take her. So maybe I'm gonna go to Felix. <laughs> Are we supposed to wait? Unclear. Coward has to leave a recording. Actually, this is a live feed. Oh. I altered the echo calm to receive the signal. See? I'm waving at you. You can see this, can't you? There you are. I need you to know I did not betray you. It was all simply part of a longer calm that had some minor complications. It was always in the plan for it to look like the money was burned to bits. 
it wasn't in the plan for this armoire to be blown out of the back of the caravan and end up sitting in the middle of the desert. What are you getting at? Open the drawer. What is going on with Fiona's eyes, by the way? <sighs> that is a lot of dough. The drawer contains nine million dollars. I expect you to split that money with your sister. And make sure she doesn't blow it all on guns. How did you do this? When the caravan crashed, you were out cold for a bit. That's when I disarmed the Hyperion explosive and swapped the real money for fake, then rearmed the bomb. It needed to look like the money was gone and you had nothing to do with it. Valerie, Hyperion, they would all be after it, and I had hoped that I could draw their attention away from you. See the money go and be able to blame me for it. Obviously, things did not work out that way. But I failed you. Had I planned things more thoroughly, this could all have been avoided. Thank you, Felix. I don't know what more to say than that. There is nothing more needed. Now listen to me. That money will not solve everything. But it will get the both of you out of your life now and into one of your own choosing. The con game, it's not for you. Not because you aren't good at it, but simply because you deserve better. You should have a life where you aren't lurking in the shadows, afraid of being recognized, afraid of being found out, of retribution. Th this life, the hustle, it's all I know. And that is precisely the reason to walk away from it while you're still young enough to do so. I'll be in touch. Give Sasha my love. Wait, no! Damn it. That is nice of Felix to leave you the money, but we are still short one team member. Please select a replacement team member. <laughs> can we? I guess we can afford the mystery choice now. I love surprises. That's settled. Let's go get our team. Let's see. Mystery. for coming. Sure. I'm mostly here for the loot. I, uh... Sorry about your mom. She was aggressively <laughs> unique. A unique woman. One of a kind. Yep.
Because love's not big enough